Greetings everyone and welcome back to more Air Force Delta Strike. Alright, let's head off to the briefing room. We just did a big freaking douchey mission. Anyway guys, apologies for the last couple videos. I was extremely tired over the weekend. I got maybe 8 hours of sleep all weekend. And I tried recur recording this at about 4 a.m. on a Sunday. When I already hadn't slept and was just wide awake. And I was like, I'm going to go ahead and try to bust out while I'm at least semi-conscious. And I didn't get any freaking sleep or get anything done last weekend. This is terrible. Anyways, apologies aside, let's continue forth. Hey, host. So you made it back in one piece. Yeah. Luckily, we managed without losing a single plane in the squadron. How did things go on your side? Not well with Jamie. Oh, I lost about 80 P-38s, but it's fine. You couldn't possibly think we'd let those cluckers get us. After cleaning up, we all flew home without a scratch. Good. I guess I was worse for nothing. And I bet I bet on who had the highest kill count. Kill count based on the camera? I don't think so. I'd rather keep my cash. Man, you're such a bore. How did the ladies come back? Captain Jones, reporting back, sir. Please don't act so formal. Now, did all my sweethearts come back unharmed? It's like freaking Master Roshi. Yes, sir. All planes returned safely. I'm glad to hear that. Care to bet on who had the most confirmed kills? Wouldn't you? Huh? You want to gamble? Based on the number of enemies shot down? That's right. A real pilot would bet on anything, no matter what. How absurd. So what do you say? You wouldn't stand a chance. John and I are both in Ruth's squadron. We wouldn't lose to an old man on a kill count. Huh! <laughs> Well, we won't have no unless we try, will we? Unless you try what? Place a bet, of course. Hey, it's my little Lilia. I thought I'd come to thank everybody for their hard work, and then I happened upon your nonsense again. <laughs> Leave the old guy alone. He's fought a World War II play for crying out loud. Eh, what nonsense? Jamie, just give it up. Hold it right there, Rick. You wouldn't turn on your old pal, would you? Of course not. But let's not waste our time with some silly little bets. Hey, man, are you trying to steal the only thing I look forward to? Man, I guess I'll have to teach you the hard way. Great. What are you trying to say now? Don't even try to get this get out of this one. What the? Was that a quake? There was a flash in the distance. That's where KOTOR is. I wonder if something had happened. Lilia. What happened, Amelia? You're pale. An enemy telegram. Emergency telegram? Oh, em I guess emergency telegram. I don't know. Okay, now just relax. Take a deep breath. And once you're ready, read it carefully. Uh, understood. Okay, ready. KOTOR's stronghold was the target of a bombardment. Lost contact with the stronghold. Repeat, we have lost contact. Lost contact? What in the cosmos hit them? Amelia, have you heard anything more? So far, this is all we received. Unbelievable. Delta Squadron, stay on alert until we receive more information. Get some rest while you still can. Artillery, artillery fire could never take out the KOTOR stronghold. What in the world did they use against it? What is going on? I can't say for sure, but it's clear that this battle isn't over yet. Meanwhile, at the Legion of Doom... <laughs> so the old man really went and died. And now Navigator has summoned me. Could this mean that my day as unit commander has arrived? The death of Citizen Sergei is a terrible loss for all of us. Announcing the new unit commander for the Burvs. This is it, this is it, this is it. The new commanding officer, Citizen Albert Unger. Any objections? Huh? This is OCC's decision. Hey, now just wait a second. What? An objection? Uh, no, I... I have an objection. I'm not fit to be unit commander. 
Huh? What do you mean? I was unable to protect the commander. I'm in no position to lead. Besides, there are still things I must do. You mean... Leon Kleiser would make a fine commander if I will continue fighting solo. Are you certain of this? We are confident of your abilities. I am certain. If that's all right with you, Leon. Er, yes, of course. Then we have a new unit commander. His, his name is Leon Kleiser. You are dismissed. Yes, sir. Um, yes, sir. Commander, I put the birth people and our comrades in the hands of a fool. I have abdicated my responsibility. All because I wish to remain true to my reason for fighting. I won't lose to anyone. I will be the best pilot ever. As for Pale Blue, he has taught me the taste of defeat. And as such, I must crush him with my own hands. Commander, I would give my soul to the devil to achieve my ends. Please forgive my selfishness. Hey, buddy! Just got some new brains in! <laughs> oh, we get more story. EDF counterattack was ordered with little for the condition of its troops on the front line. But each unit pushed hard and managed to inflict serious damage on the exhausted OCC, proving HQ's tactics highly successful. The EDAF regained the ground they had lost at the outset of the war. With an almighty push, the Allied forces eventually succeeded in taking the Kohar stronghold, which the OCC had been using as their headquarters since the war began. Welcomed by cheers from citizens hostile towards the OCC, the EDAF proudly declared victory, but their triumph was to be short-lived. With the loss of their main supply line, the weakened OCC abandoned the idea of regaining the territory they had lost. Instead, they started to annihilate the military bases and major cities in these areas using supersized railguns. Oh gosh. Oh no. Units comprising the main force of the EDA of Army had been stationed in these cities and bases, particularly in the Kotor stronghold and consequently suffered horrific damage under those new attacks. The majority was incapacitated. Military HQ promptly decided to attack the enemy's railgun batteries. Amassing all of their available units, they embarked on a campaign against multiple enemy targets. Oh, if this is the mission I'm thinking of, I'm going to have to just stop. This was the hardest mission I ran into in this game. No joke. This is pure insanity. Alright, let's go to the shop. What you got for me there, Harry? I can select a pilot. Issue 30, mm, MKI. I mean, that's pretty good, but... I mean, Ruth's got enough money where I can just kind of fling some money around. It does have 80 missiles, but it's no Tomcat. We'll hold off for now. We'll hold off. Um, I wish I could pick a different pilot. I wonder, if I go to the quarters, can I switch pilots? Nope. Alright, let's save it. Yeah, once I get a Tomcat in the game, I really don't care about any other freaking plot like jets. I'm just like, yeah, you know, everything else is kind of fun. You know, it would be nice to use uh, Ken and get his MiG-29, but I really don't care. Oh my gosh. That was a standby. Whew, okay. We're taking Jamie out because uh, we need to go look and see if he's got a plane. We have an yeah, it's just a thing. We're going to use Jamie. Because we can do it with him. 
And then when we get back to base, we can look and see if he's got a new plane finally. I do need to get some new planes with him though, because uh, the next mission, big one coming up with those rail guns, that's the one I've been scared of this whole freaking game. I hate that goddamn mission. I think it took me like a week to beat it. And I'm not going to have a week's worth of me failing at that freaking mission. I know I can do it with Jamie because he's like the key to it because he's that freaking good. Right, let's kick the throttle up. Leon. Nope. Shoot. If your ammo or power look tight, pull out of the hot zone. To give up the front. Nobody's going to come down on you for leaving the zone. If you're confident enough, fight it out until the time's up. Where's your job, God damn it? Where are the are there friendlies out here? Don't stop. There's no time for breaks. I don't think there's any friendlies out here. Is it really by my freaking self? You're too slow. Get the lead out. Let's give it some boom. Advance, we can't retreat now. Yeah, baby, there's one down. Where's your job, God damn it? Even if I die, the OCC will go on to victory. We're heroes. Every damn last one of us. Shoot! Can't Shoot ah, that's not good. Just gonna survive. Put some goddamn heart in it! I don't care what you have to do, just show me some spirit! Receive my death blow! They're all a bunch of weak knee cowards! This is us. We can do this. Pray and helps them hit the mark. No way I'm gonna die in a place like this. Stop for the deck. I don't like getting down here. We've got to attack first. Fire. Fire! Try this on precise, scum! Take some deep breaths before firing. Let's see some energy. Look alive! Let's not give him anything else to be happy about. Ha ha ha! Weak coward! No damn OCC is gonna beat us. Let's take him by surprise! Come on, people! Step up to the plate! Just let us at him and we'll tear him a new one. Try this on precise, scum! Don't crap! Ow! Oh, come on! Oh, he got me real bad. I should have, I should have went to the left instead of the right. Oh, shut up! We're gonna reload that. We're gonna go back into that one. I can't find any freaking teammates. I was doing good until I wasn't. Until the guy got right behind me and dumped a bunch of missiles at my rear end. There's two of these. Oh well, whatever. Uh, you know, I think I'm gonna take the Mustang out for this. Um, cause if we just got a quick standby, then I think the Mustang actually works better in a dogfight situation. P38 is better for some other stuff. I gotta use Jamie. Like, I gotta get a new plane for him. This Mustang P38 combo just. Really ain't cutting it too good. We ain't cutting the mustard, if you know what I mean. I just I like the Mustang because I like having the wider set machine guns. You must target enemy fighters. Don't give them control of the Okay, we do have friendlies. You turn oh. up all over. Hey Albert. Better get out of the way. I'll finish you off in an instant. I wanna go home a hero. 
Keep the airspace secured as long as possible. If your ammo or power looks tight, come pull out of the hot zone. Nobody's gonna come down on you for leaving the zone. Come here, Albert. If you're confident enough, fight it out until the time's up. I don't care what you have to do. Just show me some Enemy fear. radar raid. Advance! Fox 2. I wish we could just fight it out one on one. Well, bring it. Ooh, you gotta lift the frag up that time, buddy. A determined assault here will give us the advantage. Keep moving or you'll buy the farm. Honestly, the sluggish handling that the Mustang has is actually kind of a benefit. It does make it a little easier to aim the machine guns. I wish you gonna turn like a freaking boat. Steamroll over us. This battle is just getting started. Yeah, show me some spirit. Hold your breath when you fire to keep it steady. Where's your drive? God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's stick with the teammates. Look at me. I'm shaking with excitement. We're heroes. Every damn last one of us. I just love the cockpit view of this because Here we go. No, I can't quite see the machine guns firing, but let's give it some oomph. This could take a while. Oh, you can't see the ailerons flex. Don't stop. There's no time for breaks. I can see him flex a little bit there. Yeah. Then where you can't see it in the cockpit view. By the farm. Nothing but lily livered pukes. Just let us at him and we'll tear him a new one. Hold your breath when you fire to keep it steady. Well, you gotta hold your breath. You're not freaking firing any sniper rifle. You're pressing a button on a joystick, or on the flight stick. Actually, not a joystick. Quit messing around, and we're done for. The enemy is confused. We can't let them just steamroll over us. Let's see some energy. Look alive. We're heroes. Every damn last one of us. Come on. I want to go home a hero. Yeah, fit a cow, baby. Put some goddamn heart in it. Let's see some energy. Look alive. Well, little now, one, weren't you, buddy? in my unit. No way we're gonna lose to the EDAF. Advance, we can't retreat now. Come on and prove you're worth your pay. There'll be no hesitation out there. Victory to the OCC! You're too slow! Get the lead out! Hold out! The enemy is feeling it too! No way I'm gonna die in a place like this! Woo! We've got what it takes! They're coming at me one at a time now. Should be able to get one more. Come on, people, step up to the plate. 
run, and your family will be demoted to level 8. We got what it takes. Crush them! Damn, he yeah. Look how scared <laughs> Just survive for another minute. Fire. Fire. The enemy is confused. You're the advanced guard. Pride of the OCC. Ain't no dummies in my unit. We can't let them just steamroll over us. Just let us at him and we'll tear him a new one. Nothing but lily living for you. You're too slow. Get the lead out. This could take a while. Oh god, I lost all my composure there. Jays. They're all a bunch of weak knee cowards. Hold out now, we can win this thing. We've got what it takes. Crush them. Victory. Yeah! Right at the end. Heck yeah. Good job. True Delta style. Leave the rest of the trailing units. That helped us out. There you go, Jamie. Got you to the win. You redeemed yourself from that embarrassing failure. I think I got Albert in the mix. Hey! Ah! Alright, let's head back to base. Let's see if I got me a new plane. Please. Please give me a new plane. I just want another World War II plane. There's like three more to go. Come on. Why does Jamie not have any planes? You say, hey, there's new planes in the thing, and you never give Jamie a freaking plane. God dang it. Alright guys, well that's going to be all for today, and I'll catch you on the next one. Later!